Um, the National Assembly has been coming up with bills, but I'm saying that not normally um, the presidency in the past did not um, assent to it. It's okay. only the women's bill, I know, that the National Assembly didn't pass, but they have been coming up. They've been, that's what I said, they've been spending okay. a lot of time working on bills, but the, pres uh, the presidency in the past um, did not assent to these bills, and so it made the exercise... Um, ineffective, let me say, okay. to a large extent. Not all, all. Mm -hmm. Some bills, a few uh, were passed, but not much. So I just want to say um, that I think if we want to transform our society and change mm -hmm. this country, we must go back to the roots, which is what she said. And what is this root? The three arms of government, the executive, the legislature, and the judiciary must perform their roles because they all take an oath. They swear to the constitution of Nigeria to protect the rights of every Nigerian. And if you violate that right, there should be sanctions. And that takes me back to even what happened in, in Plato. There's no sanctions for, 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 for violating uh, uh, the rule of law. So judges who are, there's really not much sanctions for them provided in the NGC. So we need to go back to a situation where um, even in this constitutional process, as legislators take their time painstakingly to ensure that Nigerians address these issues, uh, issues of, um, you know, fed, uh, devolution of powers, the dev most states are asking that more powers, Nigerians are asking that more powers be transferred to the states and not remain at the, federate, at the federal government because, for instance, and then issues of resource control as well. Uh, you know, the federal governments get about 52% of the consolidated revenue fund and the states only get about 26% and the local government. Uh, and then we need the full independence of the local government. Okay. Um, and, you know, we need a lot to make this country run. But like I always say in Nigeria, you may have the laws, but sometimes it's the mindset.